Hello everybody, so today I have these three Vinylmation sets that, um, I think I'm gonna keep them in the boxes because they're kind of more rare and they don't make them anymore, I think. So the first set I kind of want to open is this Tarzan and Jane one, which is animation number five or from that line, and then this Lilo and Stitch one, I don't think there's a series or anything, I think it was just like a separate thing that they made, and then there's this Brave one, which I don't think there's any, uh, no, I think it's just a separate set. So here's the first one. As you can see, it's like the typical Vinylmation boxes. There's uh, concept art all over, tells you what the sizes are. And then it also shows you uh, the other set that you can get in this one, and it's Lilo and Scrump. And they tell you a limited edition of 1,500. So there's only 1,500 of these ones. So I'm pretty happy that I have one. That's that's another reason why I'm going to keep this in the box because you know it's pretty rare. So and I don't have this one. As you can see, I have Lilo and Stitch in a, in a different set. They are out of the box. They have really cool faces, paint jobs. They look awesome. And I kept thinking this was a bow because that's how it looks because this is like the Mickey um, mold and this one's like more like the mini mold. But all it is is just like so you can see her bun. So they are really cool and in the background of their ears they have the jungle and then on the back uh, some really cool detailing and I like how on Jane they show her dress because normally um, as you can see it's just like this so I think it's really cool that they have like a little part sticking down and her shoes are even kind of curled too. Or at least they're flatter, probably because of this. So yeah, you can see her bun on the top and the back too. I'm really glad they did a Tarzan and Jane. You don't really see a lot of Jane stuff. So those look really cool. So it says Lilo and Stitch. Uh, I guess you could get it in the Disney store. Who knows if you still can. And then collectible figures. It's the top. I do like how the box is, um, the packaging for it. it looks really cool. And then here's the back just showing like the art of it. I don't know if you can see that, but I'm going to leave it there if you guys want to pause and read it. But it's basically just saying that uh, these are three-dimensional canvases, and this is like exclusive vinyl figures. So I'm gonna take these out. So here they are. They're actually kind of really difficult to get out of the uh, uh, packaging. Well, not really difficult, but kind of annoying. So here they are, ready for beach time. In the background of theirs is a, a sunny sky. Well, actually there's clouds. 
Lilo in her swimsuit and then Stitch, which is, um, what is that called again? A lay? Something like that over his uh, neck. So that's pretty cool. They did a good job on their paint jobs too. And then it comes with this uh, Vinylmation Hawaii surfboard. And I think you can even um, pose them like that if you would like. But I think I saw the picture like this, like have this somewhere behind them. So that's cool. So the last one that I have in this in a set is this brave one. And it's Merida and her three brothers. Oh boy, let's see if I can remember their names. Hamish, Hubert, and uh I forgot the last one. I always forget the last ones. It starts with an H, I know that obviously. Oh, it's gonna be bothering me. So, same thing. I like the packaging, how it's like all, like this kilt. Or at least the pattern. Looks really cool. And then it's like Celtic designs on the top and bottom. And then it just shows like what they look like in this box. And these ones, you may still be able to actually get. Because they don't look at they don't cost that much or maybe they do at least the one that I got wasn't that much yeah I don't think they uh, are that rare because I could find I saw like a whole bunch it's a little rough putting that bow in there So these, these ones I think are the Disney Junior size ones, and then Merida's just the regular size 3 inch. But they, but for being so small, they still have some pretty good detailing on them. So on Merida's, um, if you can see. This one is the bear medallion that she had in the beginning of the movie that she gave to the bear witch. Well, not the bear witch, but um, the bear carver. And then this right here uh, is like the design that's on her bow on the top parts, which is kind of interesting that oops, they didn't put that on the actual bow. But it's still a pretty cool bow. That she, and it's cool she gets an accessory. And then it doesn't look like you see all her hair because, you know, she has a lot of hair. But then when you turn her around, it's all like right back here. And you can see a sword that she has. And then um, you can see like her. Uh, oh, what is that thing called? Well,. A lot of archers have it, you know, so they don't get injured, but, um, I like how it's gold. I really like the color of her dress, and then they have, like, gold on there, and then the brown. It looks really cool. Even gold on the bottom. Oh, I even, I forgot to mention the artist. This one says Ron Cohe. Well, those ones don't say it, they just say juniors. But the Lilo and Stitch ones is Enrique Pita. And the Animation 5 ones, uh, the Tarzan ones, are Caesar Jones. If you guys were wondering. So yeah, these ones look pretty cool. I'm really glad that I got this set, these sets. And like I said, I'm going to be putting them back in the packaging. Because, well, especially for these ones, because there's only 1,500 of them. 
but like these other ones I guess I don't really need them in packaging but uh, since these guys have like a surfboard it's gonna be easier that way and then these ones so I don't lose these guys because they are pretty small they're only an inch tall so I guess that's it for this uh, I hope you liked it thanks for watching bye